Okay, in case you're curious about this game, here's a quick look. It's a pretty simple but fun puzzle game. Right now it's at version 1. It's about 64 megs. There's 19 trophies. No platinum. You get 90 levels. I haven't quite unlocked them all. And you can only advance if you unlock a level. So if I don't unlock this level, I ain't getting to that level. So the idea is you start on the green square and you have to get to the red square. You step on the blue squares, they disappear. Uh, different squares have different effects. So the light blue squares, you have to hit them twice. The yellow squares flash and then disappear and the orange squares just keep flashing at different rates. That's about it for the base game. Um, there's an option to build your own levels. It's one of the easiest editors I've ever seen. Um, you make whatever map you want. You test it out. If it works, you can publish it. Uh, you pl publish it to PS4 users and PC users, and I'm assuming you're also getting maps that uh, PC users have made. Uh, once you publish it, you can't edit it and you can't delete it. You can play online maps that you've made and maps that other people have made. Um, right now there's about 665 user-made maps. The only thing is it records your score only. So if you want to see the best score somebody got on your map, um, you're not going to. You're only going to see your score. The other thing is the ability to build maps and play your maps and play other people's maps is only available if you're connected online. So once you're offline, you only have the base game. That's a bit of a downer, but what are you going to do? It's a, it's a super fun game. I think I paid three bucks for it. If it would have paid more, it would have still been worth it. Uh, too bad you can't build your own levels offline and play them offline, but that's the way it goes.